Hello everyone, I'm Rylan and I'm going to be showing you how to solo mine Raven Coin. As you can see here, um, I got the inspiration to make this video from Red Panda Mining, who uh, he tested out pool mining Raven versus uh, mining Raven, uh, uh, solo mining Raven. And he was able to get a block within 12 days. So I thought I would try it out for myself. Again, it's all kind of based on luck. So, um, hopefully I get something, and hopefully you can learn how to do this, and you might be able to get something if you uh, put your hash power towards it. Um, yeah, so let's, let's jump in. Alright, so the first thing you're going to want to do is download NB Miner, which I have right here. And I have a video about how to install NB Miner and mine Ethereum down below. Um, you can look at that, the first part of that, and it'll, I'll show you how to download NB Miner if you, wanna, if you don't know how to. That'll guide you through it. Um, but once you have MB Miner installed, uh, you can open the file uh, what, after it's, it's extracted, and you're gonna click Edit, Start, not ETH, Start RVN.bat. Click Edit. Here I have everything set up, but I'll, I'll show you uh, how to set it up yourself. So here in the after dash O is gonna be your pool address which you connect to which here is this US solo raven two miners and what you can do to find your pool address that that is closest to you you can go down here uh, after you click here solo raven coin uh, two miners and you can see right here USA if you're in Europe or Asia you can copy one of these now I'm not using nice hash I'm using just GPU miners just plain old NB miner and um, here is the address and the port you're going to copy that and paste it right here and after dash u is going to be your wallet so what you're going to do and I'll link this in the description I'll link everything in the description for you you're going to download Raven Core okay so once you open it you're going to see this and uh, what it's doing is installing the wallet or installing the blockchain I mean and installing all the transactions to keep up with it. So this is, may take quite a while um, and you're gonna wanna make sure you have enough space for it. Uh, I believe it is like over 20 gigabytes in space so uh, that's something to keep in mind. Okay so one thing I forgot to note while I was recording this was that you will not see your transactions or your balance until uh, the wallet is fully downloaded, uh, until it is caught up with uh, all the other transactions on the blockchain. You can still get a wallet address to send to uh, even while it's doing this. And what you're going to do is when you're going to want to go to receive at a label, so like minor, and uh, request payment and it'll give you a wallet address. I'm not going to do that because I already have done that. It's right here. Um, but that's what you're going to want to do. And um, I'm going to minimize this here. And the dot 3080 Ti here, this is just uh, the name of your rig and I just have a single 3080 Ti in this rig so that's why I named it that. And um, that's pretty much it. Now once you have this you can just close that and run it. And you should see any second now. Come on. Some oh oh that was that was a mistake. <laughs> I was gonna redo it, but uh, I just there we go. It's working now. But oh well. Um, so you should see it running right now. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. You're mining away now. Uh, so what you're going to do to uh, view your status is you're going to copy this control C and go to two miners what you're going to do is you're going to put your wallet address in and it could take a minute for it to show up so we're going to, I'm going to wait here a few minutes until it shows up alright so here we go it's all set up here and uh, your mega hash and all that it'll rise over time to what you're actually getting now the mega hash here is not related um, into the mega hash you would get when you're mining ethereum because it's a different algorithm 
and um, yeah that's pretty much it you can see the stats here and percentage luck uh, that will climb as soon as uh, as you mine and you will uh, gain luck and you can see here if you go to blocks the percentage of luck the people had when they mined um, their block in the most in the most recent blocks so 86 percent 169 nice 57 percent 52 percent 108 118 104 and on and on and on um, now this is very much a gamble um, I will be doing it for a little while personally but uh, I definitely will be moving back to ethereum mining soon probably I'm just hoping I hit up one block and then um, just that'll be it for me uh, for now at least um, yeah that's pretty much it um, thanks for watching hope you found this helpful and you can uh, you can start solo mining Ravencoin. Bye.